Hey everybody, it's Jen with Two Sister Bees. Welcome to the channel. Today is Savings Challenges Day, where we have something for every budget. We have our no budget games, and this is $10 every week. We have our low budget games, and this is anywhere from $30 to $50 a week. And then we have our whoa budget, and this is where I do my savings challenges with you guys. And we also have our interactive game, Hello Honey. If you have not seen this, click the link below, print it out, and get ready to play with us today. If you're new to savings challenges, I really want you to stick around on this video because I wanna go over how I got started and how you can get started too on saving your own money. And we all wanna save money, I know that for sure. <laughs> so stick around and let's get started. So when I started about a year and a half ago, I knew that I wanted to save money. That's like the obvious statement, right? I want to save money. But every time I tried to start, I would just go back into my old habits and I wouldn't stick with it. And the problem is I really didn't have a plan or any way to keep myself accountable. And Savings Challenges has given me both of those things. So let's get started with our no budgeters. And they do five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars every week. No budgeters are those that swear on everything they have that they cannot save one dollar. I have challenged all of them to save ten dollars a week with me, and so far we are doing pretty good. We have quite a bit on 100 honeys, we've already got a little bit saved up in our emergent bee fund, and we're working on our triple play monthly challenge game. So today for our no budgeters, I want to go ahead and put all $10 into 100 honeys. Okay, we've got them all colored in and we're gonna add $10 to 100 honeys. Ten. For a total of 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 73 $73. And if you're new, you're probably wondering, how do they get the $10 a week? If they swore before that they didn't have it, how come all of a sudden they have it? Well, if you watch our cash stuffing videos, those are once a week. Every week I give you guys what I call a personal mini challenge. And those are to help you save just a little bit more every week. And so far we've done things like check our car insurance and a lot of you got that lowered pretty significantly. We watched our electric bills. We checked on our cell phone bills. We worked on our grocery budget and so much more. So there's always somewhere that you can save and I just give you guys little reminders each week on how to do that. So our low budgeters are gonna be stuffing. 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, $40. And I will actually link our latest personal mini challenge at the end of this video. So in case you haven't seen one and you don't know what I'm talking about, you'll be able to check one out. And here are our low budgeter games. And I wanna start with what's the buzz. And we're gonna go with the current temperature at this very moment it is 91 degrees so we're going to add the nine and the one together for 10. and next is a lotus and lily each lotus is ten dollars we've mixed that up throughout this game but today i do want to keep them at ten dollars each and save 20. so let's color in two of these okay so we've got these two colored in for our twenty dollars and let's see how far we can get on save or spend with our last five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And how you play this game is you roll two dice. I got a five and a one. The higher number went to spend the last time, so this time it's gonna go to save. So five and one. So there's six. Four left. Let's see how we do. Five and two. So this time we're going to put the higher number on spend and the lower number on save. And what we'll do is we will put from the first one, five into save, one into spend. And then for our second roll, we will put 
two into save. And two into spend. So we will owe. $3 next week to the spend envelope. 20 going into Lotus and Lily for a total of 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91, 92, 93. And 10 for What's the Buzz, bringing the total up to 20, 40, 50, 65. So we are all done with our no and low budgeters. And now let's get ready to play Hello Honey. Go ahead and print this out if you haven't already. Today we are going to use our other game, Pick 52 to play. And I'm gonna show you why I called the game Add It Up. So we're gonna take our playing cards. We're gonna shuffle these up. So you could either play along with me and save the same amount, or you can get your own deck of cards and pull your own cards. It's totally up to you. So based off of this game, we're gonna pull three cards. Jack of Diamonds is worth $42, so we're gonna add those numbers together. Four plus two is six. Next is Seven of Hearts, and that one is worth $22. Two plus two, four. And our last card is the Queen of Hearts. She is worth 45, four plus five is nine. So we're up to $19 so far in Hello Honey. If the 19 is a bit high for you, you can add that together. One plus nine is 10 and just save 10. You guys know we're gonna do a bonus round. Now this time, we're going to subtract the higher number from the lower number. Let's see how we do. So our first card is a four of hearts, and that one is worth 13. So we're gonna take three minus one and put two. The six of hearts is worth 21. Two minus one, one. And the three of clubs is worth $8. I'm just going to go ahead and do the eight since there's nothing to subtract it from. I'm up to an even 30 bucks. I'm going to stay with that today and save that amount for Hello Honey. I also have not had a chance to add up all of your answers from last week, so I'm going to leave that one blank. And I'm going to put the 30 next to that for this week's Hello Honey. And don't forget, there are so many different ways you can take that ending number that you have and switch it up to meet your budget. If you ended up with 30 and that is just way too much for you to save, you could do $3. You could cut it in half and save 15 It's totally up to you. It's your budget, your game. Okay, so back to the newbies. If you just watched all of that and you are so excited and you really want to get started with your own savings challenges, I want you to click that link below where our freebies are and print out this income and expenses sheet. This is your first step to figuring out where all of your money is going and getting your money organized so that you can start cash stuffing or doing savings challenges or both. And then once you've got your money organized and you're tracking it, and maybe even following my personal mini challenges that we do each week. And then my suggestion is to go ahead and start the $1,000 emergency fund as your very first savings challenge. I use this one. It is available in our Etsy shop. It comes with the dashboard and three of these trackers. Once you have all of these honeycombs colored in, you will have your $1,000. Or you can start with this Immersion B Tracker, which is totally free, linked below for you guys. I also have a Cash Stuffing 101 video. 
I'm gonna put that in the description below as well. That should help you get started on doing all of this and knowing what you're doing so that you start seeing progress. So let's get to the Whoa Budgeters and see what I'm gonna be doing today. So I have two separate stacks of cash. This one goes for one game in particular, so I'm gonna put it up here to the side. And this cash goes for all the rest. So let's count this up. 150, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 240, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 50, 63, 553 total. So let's go ahead and get my 20K pot of gold savings challenge out of the way. And that is what this money was for. So let's count this up. 100, 200, 300, 400, 520. Let's color this in. And let's add it to the envelope. And we are now up to $7,040. Okay, you guys, let's pull some Busy Bee cards. We've played quite a few games. We played one with our no budgeters, three with our low budgeters, Hello Honey, and the 20K, that's six cards. Okay, so let's pull six Busy Bee cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. Honey Money is four plus three, seven. Save based on today's date. Today is the 14th, so that's $3. Actually, I take that back. Today, <laughs> Today's the 15th, so that's actually lower. That's $2. Black and yellow. What color is my shirt? White. White is $6. Six. Moody B. <laughs> this is interesting because yesterday in my video I had told you guys, oh, it's pretty cranky. But today I would say I'm neutral, right? That's progress. Three bucks. We'll go with that. Three. And odds or beaven. So I'm going to roll three dice. If more of them are odd, I save one, three, or five. If more of them are even, I save two, four, or six. Let's see what I mean. Okay, so we have two fives and a six, which means I have mostly odd numbers. So I'm going to save five. Total going in, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. And since we have this out, let's go ahead and move on to the Save 10 journey. I have big plans for this one today. So I started with my $10 bills. You have to save 10 of each denomination. I needed one to complete my 10s. So we're gonna put that to the side. Then I wanted to go ahead and finish out the fives. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And the one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
and start the 20s. We'll go halfway with five of them. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we're gonna mark off the six, seven, eight, and nine. And we've got our 20s accounted for. And then on this side, we've got the ones completed, the fives completed, and the tens. Okay, so we have 10 tens, 10 fives, and 10 ones. And I'm going to keep them in this envelope. And we've got our 520s marked off, ready to go. So let's put this binder away for a second because I have not been doing my no spend days and I'm actually not even gonna look back to see which ones were actually no spend days. What I'm gonna do is mark them with a line all the way up until today and that is 15 days at $5 a piece is $75. Going into no spend days. And I now have 50, 70, 90, 100, and 10. Okay, next let's do my 100 envelope challenge. And today I'm going to do 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, and 50. Let's get started. Okay, so we have 15, 25, 35, 45, 50, and 55. Okay, so my two placeholders are going back, 25 and 50. Okay, let's color these in. Okay, you guys, all accounted for. So I have a little bit left over here, and I think I'm actually going to the 30 that I owe for Hello Honey for today. And I have $31 left. Let's see how many busy B cards I can pull. We'll do one at a time. Wishing B. Reach into your coin stash and saved based on the coin you pull. Okay, I pulled a quarter and those are worth four dollars. Mm -hmm. 
next flower of the month save based on what month it is it is july so that's three dollars so we're up to seven honey money five honey money four honey money one Honey buns. I don't think I've gotten this one yet. Your hair looks fabulous based on your current style. I have extensions and it's kind of in a ponytail. So we'll add those together. Five plus two, seven. We're up to 24. Let's keep going. You bet your bee that any amount you wish and choose a number one to six. If you roll your number, save your bet. So I'm gonna bet that I'm gonna roll a six. I did, I did roll a six. Okay, so if I get it, I put it wherever I want. So I'm gonna put it into my busy bee. That was pretty cool. Okay, so I think I have $1 left, right? 20, 30, one. I do. Let's just see what I get. Five. Okay, so I will owe four dollars. To the Busy Bee cards. So I've got that written on there for next week. Okay, everybody, if you have not subscribed to Two Sister Bees yet, now's the time to hit the logo down here in the corner. Be part of our hive. Don't forget about all of those freebies that are linked down below for you to get started on your own savings challenges. And if you're new and you're still trying to figure out how to get a couple extra bucks, here's our latest personal mini challenge for you to watch and keep watching Two Sister Bees.